Hello everyone and welcome back to Coded by Jadu. In this video, I wanted to talk a little about my experiences completing A-levels this year, my UCAS journey and my plans for the first year of university. As always, before I start this video, be sure to like and subscribe to be the first to see my latest content. In the upcoming weeks, I have a lot of videos in the pipeline, so also turn on post notifications to be updated on every video. On the 10th of August, A-Level Results Day, I was pleased to find out that I achieved three A-stars in A-Level Computer Science, Business and Mathematics respectively, as well as an A in AS Further Maths, which I taught myself in just over a year. These were the grades I was working towards across both Year 12 and Year 13, so it was a relief for them to actually come into fruition. In terms of how I achieved them, there was nothing much that I did that was out of the ordinary compared to the study chips already available online. However, I believe that my strongest points were stopping note taking and switching over to writing questions for active recall. And for this, I use Anki, Quizlet and Notion. Time management and resilience. For more detail about how I did, be sure to check out my last video titled how I got offers to study computer science at top UK universities after this video. With these grades, I was able to get into my firm choice, the University of Bristol, Yay! to study the three year computer science course, which I'm due to start in September. To prepare for this course, the university has sent me the AMSP transition to university course on integral maths, which goes through all of the A-level maths content, as well as a bit of further maths content. I've also been actively using C++ during my course, which will extensively be using C. So I thought I would familiarise myself in a similar language to get them both under my belt. If you want to learn about how I'm teaching myself this language, be sure to check out my videos on how to learn a new programming language, as well as choosing coding projects, which will be in the information box. Finally, I want to talk a little about my plans for first year. Earlier this summer, I made a video titled Frameworks I'm Learning This Summer to Boost My CV, where I discussed my plans to learn Python Flask slash Django and ReactJS. During this time of focusing on developing my skills in web development, I realised that I'm not currently a big fan of front-end development, so for now, I'll be focusing on working on back-end development skills as this is something that I enjoy more. I therefore will spend my first year of university preparing for back-end development internships. I am already quite rehearsed in database development and management. I will now focus on learning the cloud and API design. Okay, so that was a quick update on where I am in my journey to become a computer scientist. Before I end this video, I wanted to give a quick reminder that I have created an Instagram account for you guys to ask for advice in all things computer science, from university admissions to getting into the subject yourself. Don't be shy to message me on there. That's all for this video, and I hope you'll tune in for the next one. Bye.